Oh, so um, this is Brody Knock Knockum. Uh, so we're today we're um, just talking about uh, recording. Is uh, is the volume okay? Is the checking okay? So these are little things we do when we're recording. So today we're gonna we have uh, Todd here and Josiah. Um, and we're just, uh, we're going to look at what we do when, um, we want to record elders and stuff. The stew's going to, Stuart's here too. He's going to, he's going to show like a light that. Right now, if I show what's going on here. We see the, we see the light. So we're all talking about what we do if we want to record elders and stories and anybody really, but um, community people and uh, in, I have a big light here, which is called a fluorescent. I believe it's called a tea light, hey Todd? <laughs> yeah. So, so let Todd pick up the cell phone. Todd's gonna, I'm actually going to undo this little thing I'm using. It's called a stabilizer and pass it over to Todd. Yeah, so Todd's there. As you see, he's mounted it on there. And then you just point it. Yeah. So there we go. Um, and, uh, when you want to adjust it, you think about, uh, the, the phones is that you want to get it kind of close to who you're, who you're filming. So like, I'm like me on the table here. Um, I'm actually sort of close to, I'm moving in and out with my hand right now. So, yeah. <laughs> okay, next. Okay, next, we're gonna look at the uh, Zoom recorder. So that's right beside Josiah there. So Zoom recorder, we have it on a little tripod just to keep it tidy whenever you're recording. If you're at an elder's home, it keeps you uh, organized, so it's not moving around, I guess, and you know, so you could view it quickly. And uh, so, what we got attached to it now? See the blue, two blue cords. Uh, they're they're like basically mic cables. They look like mic cables, and. Um, so they're, they're two, two lapel mics. So right now, Todd's wearing one. Um, I'm wearing, wearing one as well. So we only have two with us today, but uh, you can jimmy up more, but um, that's not what we're doing. We just, to us, you know, um, it takes away the echo in the room when you're when you're recording, sometimes you're, if you're recording at an elder's place, if you're using the microphone, say from the iPhone or any, whatever phone you're using, or from even like a camcorder, that um, it's going to sound pretty echoey if you're filming from, uh, recording the audio from far away. Uh, so it's a great idea to, uh, use lapels in my opinion and I like it and it's just something we've always done and uh, Todd will now pick up the headphones the headphones are key you know you might want to you might might think oh what do you yeah. oh, I'll just wing it but like you know sometimes um, there's on this zoom recorder for instance there's, there's two things going on. There's the record level and the volume level. So 
the, the, high, uh, the, the volume level on the headphones is different than the recording level. So you don't want to mess around with that. And then um, at the end of uh, at the end of like the recordings, when you want to like do the recordings, I, I you know just for your own documentation, when you do um, recordings, you should mention at the beginning of your recordings. You know, for example, you know May first or whatever, and 2000, you know, 20, you know, and then name the elder where you're recording it. That's super handy, you know. Um, and uh, Todd's just going to pull over the uh, the next next part there is the laptop. One more thing, too, about the lapel mics. Even though it's inside my shirt, you can clear it hear it clearly with um, with the lapel mic. It, it's very sensitive and picks it up, so it's very handy to have, like it's not even showing on me, but I can still hear it clearly I've, through the headphones. So it's it, it's extremely handy, handy thing to have. Yeah. So, we look at the, the MacBook. So, what we're showing here is uh, we're going to show what we call a card reader. So inside the uh, inside those Zoom recorders is these little SD cards. I'm not going to pull it out now because we're recording. <laughs> but uh, you just put that in and then you drag it into your computer and work with it. And the two, like when I record on the Zoom recorder, I, I always record with... Uh, under wave like you set the setting to wave not mp3 or anything like that because like uh, to me the wave when, when elders are speaking quaquila with the wave it's super detailed more detailed that way like the 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 quality is much better so um so what i'm going to show right now is uh what happens when we start taking little lights out. So I'm gonna turn off this, uh, this light, um, this light, it's called, uh, the brand is Lumahawk, but it's a really a small light. Um, it has different uh, settings and uh, just so I can turn it on a little bit to show what it does. Or talk. Oh, there goes the battery. The battery comes out. Yeah. So it clicks in. So and it lights up very well. So um, so it has different tones um, depending on what you want to do. So when you're dealing with film and, and things like that, you know, you want to um, you want to have like uh, the appropriate lighting. So they they say in film, like if you're doing film and you're using blue light, it means like the cold is more of a technical or cold feel. But if you use like the the different tones of like, um, is it is it like gold or yellow or that type of light that you're having a warm feeling, feelings are being expressed, you know, or it's a friendly feeling. So bear that in mind, you know, when you're recording, I guess. Uh, There's just something that I thought of or was, uh, came to my mind. So, uh, yeah. And um, so Josiah can adjust whether it's bright or not bright. Or the other one, the other knob, Josiah. Turn it down now. 
yeah, turn it lower, and then, <clears throat> yeah. So that's really handy. You could almost fit all of this into your backpack, eh? So, um, I'll ask Stu to put the light back in place. So, brighten it up quite a bit again. So if we're getting really serious on what we're doing here today, right now, I would try to, I guess it's called framing, is that right? You're framing. So right now we have a nice framing on, see how Todd's eyes are, are lit up into the lights and then whenever Josiah looks over his art as well, that's really what you want um, uh, when you're recording to make it look cool. <laughs> so, uh, anything else to add, Todd, before we wrap her up? That about covers it. Yeah, yeah. So, thanks to uh, Todd and Josiah and Stu, who's on the sidelines with me. Um, so, we uh, just wanted to cover some of the basics here today, and uh, yeah, so thanks guys, that's a wrap. Thanks for watching.